I don't know why I like this story so much, but I do. Um, a mother and son face charges on adultery because the mom had sex with her son. Let's look at him, shall we? Uh, this is <laughs> Melissa Nell Hitchens. Kitchens? Kitchens. Kitchens, um, 44 of Weaverville. A warrants alleged that she engaged in sex sometime last month with her son. Here he is, Sean Thomas Pfeiffer. So they, if they are convicted, they face up to three years in jail. Now, Sean, the son, is also was previously arrested on August 28th. Uh, on various charges, including liberties with a child stemming from an incident that took place on August 13th. So he, the son who had sex with the mother, was arrested for taking liberties with a child, um, which is a level five felony. Um, this is not the only incest story in the news. Um, let's take a look at this other lovely couple, Patricia and Misty Spawn. They were arrested for incest in Oklahoma a little while ago. Uh, they both love Superman. <laughs> Like mother, like daughter, and they all—they got married, and so they're related by blood. In a court, and then you can't marry your kid. That is, even if you don't engage in sex, you can't marry your kid in Oklahoma, because that is considered incest. So there's a story that's worth clicking on. What do you guys think? Well, incest is almost universally universally illegal. Actually, it, it depends it state be. by state difference. Like, is it is a marriage illegal? Is sexual penetration illegal? It's there's reasons for it. I mean, there are. A lot of the, the incest taboo relies on not wanting inbred children. Yeah. But even in cases where you can't have children, a lot of affinity relationships, like your step-parent, your adoptive parent, that's also covered by incest laws because there is a social aspect there. It's not just a biological thing. What's wrong with it? Like, it's what's, what's so wrong with it? It's gross, yes. But some people say, listen, gay sex is gross. Make it illegal. What's wrong with with letting these there's two a, consenting physical, adults? I mean, it, when it comes to two, when have it comes to two sex, family members babies. having sex, if they go to have babies, there's a very high chance of deformity, uh, which can happen through incest. What if they're not having a baby? What I if they engage said, in it's sex? It's covered that way because there is a social aspect of this person is my parental figure. This parent person is my child. It completely psychologically there's a damage there. What if they reunite? later on down the line. Mm -hmm. By the way, this woman reunited with her child, Misty Spawn. They hit it off, it says in the article, <laughs> and they got married. They're not gonna have a kid. Biologically, they're both female. Mm -hmm. So why, is it, why do I give a crap as the state of Oklahoma? Why do I care? I query that. What do you think? I mean, you, you make a compelling point to try and break through the initial wall that is up. And by the way, the point you make about how, like if you're talking 20, 30 years ago about gay, uh, gay relations, is the same probably mind frame that people would have at that point, right? But uh, it, it's hard to try and fathom a reasonable explanation for family members sharing the exact same blood who emerged from the same family line in engaging in sexual relations. Because it's not, again, it, like I understand the, 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 the thought process of um, and relating it to issues that have been frowned upon. But I will never stand by the instance of breaking up a family mold through sexual relations. Like you, as you said, there's gonna be people that are gonna be discarded from their family because they like to, uh, if perhaps that family isn't welcoming to gay relations and it doesn't stand by their religious values or their thought values, but it's not of the same destruction that would cause if family relations were starting to have with each other. You're going to raise All I'm saying, saying is these death? sound like the exact same arguments about mm. what a family should stand for and what it should look I like. I don't think homosexuality is the mm. same as incest. I, it, it's a, not a black and white I picture. don't think you're making that, uh, that assumption. I think you're talking about the way that we uh, are trying to wrap our head around why it's not Ex why this is not acceptable in, in comparison to one thing is acceptable in, a so in, in society. There was a study in Iceland. Now, we just talked in the previous video about how studies from Iceland you should <laughs> not necessarily trust. When they're written by Americans. Well, uh, there was a study in Let's Iceland that money. said maybe the best compatibility genetically is between third cousins. But Iceland's because also it's not a country where they have issues with, uh, there's apps actually to determine if someone that you've met is your biological, like your cousin. And that's why they did cousin. this study. They're like, well, how compatible is two, or how close is too close? 
and versus what's far away enough. And they said that it's possible. It, they concluded that third cousins was the right amount of distance between relatives where you won't have the inbreeding effects adversely and you will won't be so far away genetically that certain you know that you are compatible that you can have there's no like rejection of kissing whatever. cousins are different than mother child than parent child humping, humping there, baby there's, humping. there's nothing there's nothing I, I would argue the case that there's nothing more humane in this world like the for the love that you have for a family member right whether it's you're raised by your mom that 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 is what I think in this world that a lot of people hold strongest values when it comes to two people connecting with each other. Mm -hmm. That's not sexually. That's just simply because one loves sharing a love with another. And again, I understand that when you come to these same thought process of people 20, 30 years ago, and still now, we're like, no, but a man should love a woman. And a right. woman should love a man. But it's the, the, say, the argument, as far as I'm aware, is never the thought process like a mom should be allowed to love her son. It's, yeah. It's, it's socially... It, yeah, definitely f the same things that uh, apply when it comes to um, pedophilia. Like, yes, you're the mother. You knew that when it was a baby. And so you shouldn't be having sex definitely with your underage baby. I think the reason legally is because, like, if you're having sex with your kid when they're 25 and you're 44 or whatever, like... We're going to arrest you because there was probably something really terrible happening when that kid was younger, especially if your kid is ha is arrested for, you know, illicit activities with a minor. Yeah. Like I think that's more the legal argument. And I it took me forever to figure out what is what how is this different from telling gay people they can't have sex and get married? I think and, it's exceedingly different from telling gay people they can't but like, have sex and from get a married. legal from a legal perspective. Yeah, that's it's very weird. It's it's like, oh God, it seems wrong, but why? Young Turks membership. I can't tell you how good that feels and how good that tastes. Find out. TYTnetwork.com slash join.